Hey guys, Bill here. You know, the Amazon's filled up with all sorts of river monsters, and one of the most famous is the piranha. But one of the biggest, and one of my favorites, is this one they call the arapaima. Today I'm with my friend and pro fisherman, Steve Townsend, sometimes called the fish finder. We're deep in the Amazon where we hope to catch one of these monsters for a close-up and personal encounter. We're going to try and get through this little narrow creek here. We've got a rock in the way, so we might not be able to do it. But the idea is to come in, quietly paddle through, and there's a hidden lake back there. They prefer this. They like a nice, quiet life. Uh, they don't want to be hassled by other predators because they're really easy to catch. One of the reasons why they're easy to catch is because our apimas are air breathers. Because they just come up, gulp air and go down. So you cast at them or in front of them and bang, they'll hit. One, two, three. It all sounded like we could get this done quick, but no sooner did we get to the lake than we began to hear thunder and see lightning. That's not good when you're in an aluminum boat, so we took cover. But like I always say on Bill's channel, when the going gets tough, the tough reach for the cooler. After a while, we realized it was too dangerous for us to stay out on the open lake, so Steve decided to explore a smaller creek. Oh, look, there's, there's one there. There's another one as well. That's two there. One's a bit smaller. He's right there. He's going to have this. He's right there. Right there. Ooh, there you go. What the hell was that? Can you take it? Here he goes. He's got it. See that float go? Yeah. Here he goes. Here he goes. And we're on. <laughs> Whoa, look at that rod bend. Oh, we got us an arrow primer, girls and boys. Fish. Wow. 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 Hey, Steven, let's try and take him over there on that, on that sandy bit over there. <laughs> I'm up here. Okay, Steve. This is a real Amazon river monster. <laughs> this is how it's done. Just love these fish. They are absolutely loopy. These fish. What do you want me to do to bring him bring up to shore? There's a, there's a log here, maybe towards you, huh? Or this way? No, okay, this way. Is he done? What do you reckon, Steve? Oh, that's way bigger than 160 pounds, man. That's way, way bigger. He's finally, finally. Ah, man, that's a huge fish. 
That is a huge fish. You got him? This is a beautiful old prehistoric fish. Prehistoric all the way. Wow. Is that a beautiful fish or what? That is fantastic. This has got to be. Come on, William, what do you reckon? 200? 200? Yeah. We'll give him 200. Wow. We'll give him 200. They are the largest scaled freshwater fish in the world. And they're, oh good, he's just taking a gulp of air. See what he did, just whoop, big gulp of air. That means he's ready to go. And he's given us a good inning, so let's, let's put him back. It'd be my absolute privilege to put this fish back. Okay, boy. And away, and away he goes. Hey, Steve. Yeah. So there you go, Bill. I got wet just for you to give you another Amazon River Monster. Great one. Thanks, Steve. That was an amazing fish. I will not forget that one for sure. Incredible. And now, here's a little sneak peek at what's coming up next in this series. I'm tired of him coming up the beach every time I'm trying to do my teeth. <laughs> 